A cycle is a series of things that happen over and over and over again. Nature is full of them. A life cycle is all the different steps that a plant or animal goes through as it grows older. Let's take a look at the life cycle of the New Mexico Spadefoot Toad. It's amazing. Toads and frogs belong to a group of animals called amphibians. These animals can live in water and on land. The Spadefoot Toad is the official amphibian of the state of New Mexico. Even though it lives in a desert, a very dry, hot place, water is an important part of its life cycle. To keep away from the hot desert sun, the toad buries itself underground. It's nice and cool down here. The toad stays here for up to 10 months each year, waiting for the rainy season to come. When it does, there is a lot to get done, and fast. Get ready, world! Here I come! It pours and pours, but the rain puddles don't last long. The hot sun quickly dries up all the liquid. This is called evaporation. Look closely, and you can see thousands of eggs in the large puddles of rainwater. This is the first step in the Spadefoot Toad's life cycle. Good luck, little guys! At first, the young toads, known as tadpoles, grow inside the eggs. They need to hurry and grow fast before the water dries up. And they do. These desert toads can change from one life stage to the next faster than any other amphibian. The tadpoles break out of their eggs in less than a day. They look more like tiny fish right now, but watch what happens. In just two weeks, the tadpoles grow legs and lose their tails. That's more like it. They also begin to breathe air outside of the water. By now, the water is nearly dried up. The young toads must find a meal quickly, then bury themselves in the sand. Sorry to eat and run. Here, they wait for the next rainy season. They grow into adults, and the cycle starts all over again. These toads are off to explore the big outdoors. What surprised you about how the spadefoot toads grow?